Well, hey guys, uh, I want to do a quick review on a new chronograph I got. It's from Caldwell. It's the Ballistic Precision Chronograph. Um, there, there's not a lot of uh, reviews and stuff out on the internet for this, and you know, there's a, a lot of uh, chronographs out there that are tried and true. But I went ahead and took a chance on this. Um, I think the, the whole package for everything you see here was around $120 on Midway. So, good deal. Hey guys, so uh, my camera at the range kind of junked out on me as I was uh, trying to do an initial review of this uh, Caldwell chronograph, uh, ballistic precision chronograph. Uh, just real quick, let's go over. Comes in a nice bag. Once you get the, the deluxe kit, uh, there is a, a kit where it just comes with just the chronograph, uh, the sunshades, things like that. But this actually comes with, with sunshades, came with a tripod that you can mount the chronograph on, which is nice. We've got the tripod mount on here. Um, tripod, basic uh, feet per second, meters per second. And then you've got a USB jack and an audio jack here that go, actually goes to the audio jack of your smartphone or uh, you know iPhone or Android phone and as you'll see in some of the videos coming up uh, I had a little bit of problems with the Android app um, some people were saying they had Androids I've got a Galaxy S3 I'm not sure uh, what the deal was but you'll see later on I hooked it up to my iPad and it worked just fine so uh, it comes with a 25 foot audio cable it comes with lights if you're shooting in uh, low light conditions, uh, things like that, you know, in the early morning or in the evening, you can do that. It comes with a battery pack for the lights um, and an AC adapter uh, that you can use instead of the battery pack. So, uh, from what the directions say, the battery pack won't last too long, but it may be enough to get in a few strings um, or a lot of strings. I don't know. I haven't used it yet, so. I've always gone shooting uh, when it's light out so far, but that's the components. Uh, it, it works pretty good. It takes a 9 volt battery in here, and uh, it's lasted three or four times. Okay, I had to run off my munchkins real quick, but uh, that's basically what comes with it. Uh, you know, uh, coming up uh, right after this, I've got some videos uh, of me uh, attempting to use it with the my Android phone, and I actually had a lot of good luck with the the iPad and it recording shots and that's one of the things that's really cool you can uh, it'll record all the your strings on there you can name the strings if you're reloading this is a really good tool you can name your strings okay I'm 9 millimeter 115 grain with 5.3 grains of Winchester Auto Comp set at you know 1.12 overall length uh, you can have a big long name like that shoot you a string record your Record how many feet per second it's going. It'll really help you dial in uh, your rounds if you're into reloading. So, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Oh, I had an error there. But as you can see, for the most part, uh, it, it's capturing those those shots. Yeah, this, you know the. The chronograph seems to be working great. It's it's getting all the shots. You know, this function, I'm not sure uh, how it's going to turn out. But as far as the chronograph goes, if you want just a chronograph, I think it was $80. So uh, it's probably still not a bad deal if you want to get just a chronograph. The app was free. So uh, it seems to be recording all the shots on there. No problem. Hey guys, just a little update on my uh, Caldwell Ballistic Precision Chronograph I got. Uh, it doesn't have any of the features of uh, memory and all that stuff in it. But what it does have is the ability to go to an Android or Apple device through a uh, headphone a long audio cable. If you come over here you'll see 
I just shot a five groups with uh, some 124 grain Hogden hollow points and it worked really well on the iPad it, uh, it functioned just fine I can't get the seem to get it to work on my Galaxy S3